reflections of Ramanashramam. My stay at Ramanashramam has had a profound effect. Bhagavan's presence is so potent, like the air pressure in and around everything. While I was there, his presence was so utterly natural and continuously affirmed that I just lived in it. Upon returning to California, his presence became startling in contrast to everything here. Like the vast ocean underlying the waves and foam and splash of droplets, I can see both right now. Bhagavan clearly elevated me beyond my actual development and I am protecting his guiding force as carefully as I can. I am completely happy but I am watchful because I know this will fade without vigilance. The most precious moments were the ones spent in the old hall. During that 4 a.m. hour, he showed me that humility, sincerity and surrender opened the current of communion with him. Reflection then revealed these three to be the same thing. In spite of my awkward and ill-prepared efforts to be still and absorb everything, he gave freely and graciously. The most surprising thing is that I miss the mountain. I miss Arunachala. I didn't realize it had such a powerful effect on me until I left. Though I know ultimately that Bhagavan's presence is not located in any one place. My heart longs to be at Ramanashramam again. I am grateful to those who live there and keep it as a safe place so that a longing heart can commune with Bhagavan in peace. There is another remarkable effect that Ramanashramam had on me. The clear light of reality that permeates the atmosphere there illuminated some of my illusions, even those dearly held. The confrontation with my own sincerity revealed a naivete in simply clinging to Bhagavan without making a real effort, along with an ironclad commitment to see through my own illusions. For me, it takes both devotion and inquiry, and Bhagavan showed me the weakness of both my devotion and inquiry in a single startling moment, another 4 a.m. gift. I feel as though I am just now beginning. In conclusion, he reached across decades and physical boundaries to capture my heart five and a half years ago. My stay at Ramanashramam gave me a constant and intense guidance from him that has set me more truly on his path. My aspiration, source,